Hello everyone, it's 4 a.m. here in Panama City and I just finished packing all my stuff. It's still super dark outside and I'm heading to the airport right now because in a few hours um, my flight to Paramaribo Suriname is departing, which is gonna be my country visit in number 91 and I'm really excited. Let's go. pulled out because um, we didn't bring a visa and according to re regulations we can have a visa on arrival for Mexican citizens but they say we cannot get it anymore starting from this year 2020 and we used to go passports and they wouldn't let us in and they say we're in big trouble so let's see what happens. Around 30 minutes later, a couple of immigration officials came towards us and explained that they had changed their visa policy recently, and as a consequence we couldn't get a visa on arrival anymore, but an electronic visa that takes 4 days. We tried to explain to officials that we had a fully booked trip in Suriname, Guyana and French Guyana, and we asked for the possibility of having a transit visa. Without any luck, they escorted us back into two more airport security checks and finally in the plane back to Panama and then to Mexico. They also put their passwords and boarding passes in a sealed envelope that was handed to the cabin crew. As soon as we landed in Panama, the airline staff was waiting for us to put us on the next flight to Mexico City. We asked the flight attendants to take a look at the envelope where our passwords were retained and we asked them if we were deported from Suriname. They explained to us that we were not deported but not admitted in the country. And during the flight, the main difference is that deportees are not allowed to drink alcohol during the flight. At the end, my experience in Suriname was not even close to my expectations. But, the immigration officers treated us respectfully, although the measures they took were quite severe. But I must say that this is not the first time that I encounter problems and adversities during my travels. And please don't let this video stop you from visiting the amazing country of Suriname, but read carefully the visa policy. If you like this video and you want to see more about my travels, don't forget to subscribe and follow me on my social media. Thanks for watching.